Hey everyone, guys, and welcome to another Nikkei video. And a ho, 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 Christmas has come early. Uh, before we jump into it, I do want to just quickly address uh, some of the comments on the previous um, Christmas rupee video. Uh, my honest thought is that obviously Christmas rupee is quite good, okay? But I did probably think that she was going to be much better uh, from my initial judgment and of course her being a limited unit so very hard to limit break and whatnot in my in-depth review i will bring the team composition test as well as uh, some of the comparisons such as with ludmilla and uh, noise in that regard so uh, thank you for the uh, commenters that did make that suggestion i will take a look at that so Thanks. Um, so going back into the event. So this is our Christmas event. It's a two-part event, and I'm hoping to give you the complete guide, okay? There's quite a lot of things to unravel. Of course, if you have played this game from the start, you probably know everything, okay? However, for some of you guys that are more casual, here is what you have to know. So there's two components. Basically, story one is the easy mode, and story two is the hard Please mode. And um, they have a map this time instead of the usual, I guess, selecting the stage. And wow, look at those soft cushions. <laughs> you can see what uh, units boost your reward. So this is the event currency that drops from clearing the stages. You want to have those units in your team in the sense that uh, rupee gives 60% and if you run Exia with her it's 100% to drop 50 of these all right you don't get any bonus ones if you go over 100% and you have to have them in your team versus you know um, just having them in your inventory and of course even as a free to play player you can get Neve tomorrow and with these it's already 70% and any of these SSR will push your bonus rewards to 100% and they've made it super easy this time like the power requirement is so tiny <laughs> I think they made it a bit too easy this time but anyhow you make sure you do your five attacks every single day as this refills every day all right this refills every day um so if you're capped at five out of five it doesn't refill for you and uh after you get the uh the yes. snowflake is it snowflake uh, basically you're able to go into uh, the shop and exchange items using these currencies okay you're also able to buy extra attempts but do not buy those extra attempts until hard mode is unlocked all right until hard mode is unlocked because uh, hard mode unlocks on the 14th uh, which is in six days Okay, this unlocks and then you'll be able to uh, use the entry tickets more efficiently because hard mode drops better things. Hard mode drops better things, all right? And of course, there's also the login event. Oh, it's not tomorrow, it's day three. You get uh, the free SR, which is... Oh my god, the badonkas. <sighs> I, I can't get distracted into focus. But yeah, so those are the shops, login stamps. Make sure you do the story. Um, for now, you can just repeat the core dust stage or whatever stage you need using the correct things. And um, you can also review the story here. Uh, two more things that we need to go over. One is the mini game. Uh, it's very difficult to get a high score if you are on, on your phone. However, there is a way. Um, Basically, you use four fingers to tap, and on the emulator, you key map things. Okay, I'll show you later, but make sure you collect everything in the missions. You get your daily, so this time, there is a daily as well. So, this is different, okay? This is different from before. We never got a daily once. So, this time, you get a daily with additional rewards, okay? And also the challenge as you clear through the games. But, um, all right, let's talk about... In this event, there's also now these hidden relics. So there's one here. Okay, I'll show you all the hidden relics at the entrance of the location of the gate. There's another if you just click on the login stamp with Emma. Uh, there, you there we go. It's right next to the login stamp with Emma. There's another one here. Uh, right next to the Ferris wheel. And then the last one, the fourth one, is right here. This little hill right here. Okay, that's how you get the fourth one. Uh, I already claimed that one, so it's probably not going to show for me yet, but this is where you go get it. So only four, all right? All right, let's talk about the mini game because I think a lot of people struggle with that. You have your gloves, which are entry tickets, and uh, there are multiple ways to go about it. First is if you have an iPad, I think it's the easiest way to do it uh, because uh, most, people, most people struggle not with the sorting part, but rather with the part where you go into the full burst, all right? That's where people struggle. Uh, okay, I'm, I'm clearly struggling with the sorting. God, my boomerangs. So this is where people struggle because if you, even if you click 
on um, using the emulator with the mouse, it's not as fast. Of course, on the phone, you're going to get a, a carpal tunnel, all right? You're going to get carpal tunnel. So I can't even exit out this. Okay, right, we'll just wait until the timer is done. So what do you want to do is if you're on your iPad or your iPhone, iPhone might not be good, uh, big enough for Android. You want to like use multiple fingers and tap here at the same time when you do a burst. If you're on your computer, you can key map it. All right. So for example, I will map one, two, three, four. Uh, I don't think you can see it, but using my link in the down in the description, you can download um, basically the emulator for it. And you can essentially, I'll save this. All right. Using this. Let's retry using spamming this. You see what I'm doing? So we do here, we do sorting. And uh, here, 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 here. Okay, full burst. So I'm spamming right here. Look at this. I'm spamming the keys. One, two, three, four. Those are my map keys. All right. And this way you can get it much, much faster. And oh my God. I can't talk and do this at the same time, but see, you'll be able to uh, do this much, much faster. Yeah, it's just some more practice. I think you only need to hit 20K once and you'll be good to go. And you'll be good to go, All right? So keep at it, keep practicing, and uh, I'm sure you guys will be able to do it, All right. So if you on your PC, you can do it this way with key mapping. Uh, just bind the multiple keys. If you're on your uh, uh, tablet, use multiple fingers to tap. All right, that's how you do it. That is how you do it. And I think to get the full reward, to get the full reward, you basically need just to get 3,500. And uh, with the mission, um, there's a mission for 20K score, 20K high score. So that will need some practice. <laughs> That will need some practice. But anyhow, it's uh, Tamayas here. Overall, I think this uh, this event's quite good. I enjoy it. Um, of course, there's more to do when the hard mode gets unlocked. So we'll have more videos. And tonight, we'll be doing more viewer polls, of course, for Christmas rupee. All right. So stay tuned for the live stream in about three hours when this video goes live. So see you there. And uh, it's Tamayas here. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye-bye now.